19 has taken a tremendous toll on the U.S. as deaths approach half a million people. But how does it compare to other pandemics and mass casualty events the country has faced in the past? We're taking a look at the numbers based on the total number reported as of January 22nd. Let's break it down. COVID-19 is more deadly than most other pandemics that have hit the United States, except for the one in 1918. On January 22nd, COVID had killed 410,000 people in the country. The 1918 flu pandemic took 675,000 lives, and health experts aren't expecting that many deaths this time. But it has been much, much worse than the 1968 influenza pandemic, which killed 116,000 people, and the 2009 H1N1 pandemic that killed 12,469. When you look at COVID compared to other deadly diseases, it hasn't killed quite as many people. Again, on January 22nd, COVID killed 410,000 people in not quite a year. The average death toll in 2020 for heart disease was 655,000 and for cancer, 606,520 people. And compared to people lost during famous moments in history, COVID is right up there. For instance, in World War II, the U.S. saw 405,399 military casualties. So as President Biden pointed out January 22nd, we've already passed World War II American casualties. 58,000 members of the military were killed in Vietnam. We blew right past that with COVID numbers. And remember how awful everyone felt on 9-11 when 2,988 people lost their lives in the attack. More people than that were dying every day in mid-January.